Hello, this is perpendicular and parallel lines. Perpendicular lines in the coordinate plane, example 5. And uh, here we have um, this example uh, gives us the equation of this line. And we have to find the equation of a second line that passes through this point, 4, 0, and is perpendicular to the first line. And uh, this is possible um, <coughs> as long as it's this situation. Uh, here's the line, uh, or, or a some given line, whatever it is. And here's a point. And now they want the equation of the line that goes uh, through this point, but is perpendicular um, to, the, to the original line. So what they want oops, is the equation of this line and and this is possible of course as long as this point is not on the original line and if you put in 4 comma 0 you'll see it does not satisfy that first equation so uh, we have to find uh, the new line has a slope of positive one-half. See, this slope is negative two, so the negative reciprocal is going to be positive, and the reciprocal of two is one-half. So for our line, the slope is going to be one-half, and it goes through the point four comma zero. And um, uh, this is not the y-intercept, it's actually the x-intercept, but uh, I would use point-slope formula. I think most of us would use point-slope formula. y minus y, y1 equals m times x minus x1. So y minus 0 equals 1 half times x minus 4. So that's the uh, equation of the line and um, just to show that it's the same as the book uh, we would make this y equals 1 half x minus 2 and y minus 0 is y and distributing this one half you get this and that's the answer they got in the book. <laughs>